You know, I think that every gay adult is a gay role model to a certain extent because we have to be the family members and the leaders for the younger gay community because they may not have a parent or a family member or someone in their inner circle to trust or to show how to live life. So whether we like it or not as gay adults, we are role models and we have a responsibility to our younger generation and we have to take care of each other. And uh, I think that I realized that when I was in the Book of Mormon on Broadway and I was playing a openly closeted gay character um, and, you know, a, a Mormon who says like, yes, I have gay thoughts, but I just turn them off. And, you know, growing up Catholic, that was what my philosophy was to get through my gay thoughts. So I certainly identified with that. And I was getting so many letters from young people who were saying, I've never told anyone I was gay. My parents would be so angry. And it was, to be honest, incredibly overwhelming. So I talked to uh, different gay organizations that I trusted and said, how do I respond to a young person who says I'm the only person they've ever told? And I came up with a, uh, a, a guideline like of how to respond to people. And I really like, I was getting sometimes a dozen letters a week over, uh, over the internet or at, at um, the stage door. And, you know, hopefully they have some other folks in their life, but my God, if I was the only person that they reached out to, that responsibility became so strong. And because I was such a theater nerd and put, people on Broadway on such a pedestal, I felt incredibly determined to respond to every single one. So I said like, this is, these are the different organizations you can talk to and reach out to and know you're not alone. And I'm so honored that you would reach out to me. And you know, that, that was the position that I was in at that time. And I think that because of playing that role in the theater community and because of being an out married gay man and you know talking about it openly I continue to receive letters but it's funny how they really have gotten uh, more optimistic because I think it the culture has gotten more over optimistic. time yeah. they have <laughs>